No, no, I throw it on back a little bit. <laughs> Just feather it. Yeah, yeah. Well, guys, you've seen it. We are at Russo's Marina, UFC. This is the intro to the next day because this day's already over. <laughs> we're all set up. We have no water to fish. I know where we're going. And the funny thing is I was going to go to a spot where I thought we would be able to get a like a small limit, but we're not gonna go there. <laughs> we're gonna go somewhere else. See if it works out. I don't know. We'll see. But we got a tent this time. We're not sleeping in the truck. This is cool. We got. Uh, I think it's gonna be cool though. Yeah, I'm chilling. We got little mattresses. We got my blanket that my daughter made me. So. I think we'll be all right. But other than that, we'll see you guys tomorrow morning. No. Yes. Well, morning, yeah, 11 o'clock. But we'll see you guys tomorrow. UFC 10 kicks off. See if we can move up in the ranks. Last year we finished 17th. I think we finished 17th. Was it 17th? It was just out of the we were money. Just out of the money. How much far does we got it a pay? gift card. I don't know. 17th or 18th it was top 20 so we'll see see if we can move up in the rankings but UFC 10 starts tomorrow peace out It's almost time. UFC 10 is here, the Ultimate Frog Challenge here in the California Delta at Russo's Marina. We have close to 200 teams getting ready to rock and roll, getting ready to rumble, and may the best frog win. We have the Bass Hole here. They are selling all kinds of frog. This event, you can use any frog you choose, and it's a beautiful day out here. We're gonna see you guys at weigh-in time. We're gonna see who's gonna be the ultimate frog. Trev, where are you at? Hey, coach, what's going on, coach? That's right, we're doing It's a family reunion. Exciting man, uh, met a lot of people, and we're out here. Regardless of the fact, whatever happens, it's gonna be fun. It's kind of windy, so it's gonna be kind of rough. Um, 
but we're gonna make this run. I'm gonna do it. I have a I have a spot that we're gonna go to first, and I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna let the weather stop me this time. We're going. We're gonna send it. I didn't put the GoPro up in the back right now because I don't want it to get soaked. And because uh, I know we're gonna be hitting a lot of waves. Uh, we got Sack Pirate in front of us. Sack Pirate! <laughs> we got Sack Pirate in front of us. It's, it's a good time out here, man. It's gonna be a good time. So come on, guys. UFC 10 is underway. Let's go. There's a frog. So why aren't we getting bit? Well, let me be careful because that fool. Look. Will... Ooh. I was about to say, be careful. That fool will come and smoke that thing. He almost did. Is he still on that top of there? That thing is huge. I can't even see him. He's sitting right on top. I think I see him. Right actually. next to that stick. Yeah, right. right. Like, yeah, right to the right of that. Yeah, look. Oh no! <laughs> Don't do that. That boy is huge. I'm not gonna play with you, bro. Did you get some trigger happy gum? Oh, that was the smallest fish in the world. Did you end up getting some or no? No, I was gonna get them either when we come back or tomorrow. I think I have one in the bag. I need to put one on. Oh, why, does that rod need one? Yeah. Oh, damn. But I think I have one. I have some in there. I think I have blue ones in there too. Oh man, dude, looks like they sprayed this shit. God damn <laughs> Come on, you bastard. Bro, well, you're 0 for 2. That's me now, yeah. Guys, I would do an update with the big camera, but nothing to update. there's nothing really to update. <laughs> uh, we're getting whooped right now by the jungle. And I have. I have, I'm at a, I'm at a loss for words, but just hoping we make the right decision towards the last hour, and we end up picking the right spot, able to get some, some bites because this is, uh, this is getting rough, man. We'll see, you guys. Christ, I wish the wind wasn't a thing. Yeah, this wind is definitely not, not cool. <laughs> Hella small. What is it? Hella small. <laughs> the whole, the whole body came out the water. Yeah. You missed again. Um, I don't know if I missed. <laughs> There's a difference. Okay, you look at the miss. I just set the hook. <laughs> you either got it or you don't. But this bait's coming back at me. What the fuck? You my, hooked them that time. I didn't. You didn't hook them? Nope. Oh man. That's what I'm saying. I don't know what I don't what? What am I supposed to do? He hit the crap out of it. Alright, look, we're out here at UFC 10. On uh, over here cooking some carne asada. <laughs> Adrian pulls up from CC Bates. A little special delivery. 
you know, I, I, I want to show y'all, but I don't want to show y'all. Because when I started throwing these and started showing that with the fish that I'm catching, but he made this special color for me right here, a special request. And you guys already know, if you don't know, now you know. He, he, does, he does special colors, he does custom colors. You can hit him up. You guys already know, I'll put his uh, link in the description down below. I'll put his Instagram somewhere on the screen. Um, just hit him up, let him know Coach sent you. But yeah, man, I mean, let him know, man. I mean, I know we talked before. You've been yes, on my videos before. I always like to promote, but let them know what you can do. I mean, you do you do it all. I appreciate it, guys. Well, listen up. We do soft cost, custom plastics, any color. You can reach us out at ccbates 22 on Instagram and on Facebook as well. He's going to put all the link in the description. We do all colors, um, custom paintings as well for hard bait. So just hit us up. Let us know. We'll right, work it cool. out for you guys. Now, quick question. Let's say somebody brings a blank bait to you. Yep. Will you, will you custom paint that for you? Definitely as well. There you go. Just you hit us up. We'll, got, we'll hey, make it happen. He'll make it happen. So hit him up and uh, let him know I sent y'all. <laughs> All right. This is the best boat inspector in the world. <laughs> <laughs> trying to get extra pounds from you, ain't slick. <laughs> All right. How's y'all doing, Greg? guys day two I didn't even do an outro for day one I apologize but you know it's kind of hard to do an outro when you didn't catch no fish actually it's kind of easy because you just don't do an outro <laughs> it's that simple but leading it is um, 17 pounds it was a uh, hun, hun 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 and his wife yeah I, believe I, I think that's how I say his name I apologize if you know I messed up your name man but he got a nine pounder so we're gonna run out here and just have fun today because whatever happens, happens. You know, we'll see what happens, see what we can do. Uh, is that sack fire in front of us again? Looks like it, huh? <laughs> yeah, it looks like it. <laughs> but um, we'll see what happens, all right? You know, so day two, UFC. A little less excited today <laughs> than we were yesterday. But you know what, though? They also sprayed everything. They sprayed all kinds of stuff today, man. So they kind of, uh, or yesterday, I don't know when they sprayed it, but everything was dead. So we'll figure it out. But all right, guys, see you guys on the water. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? <laughs> <laughs> Did he even hook it again, bro? Oh, man. God damn it. It's too early, dude. Huh? It's too early for that. There's a second cast. We need you to catch these, dude. He's not eating it, man. Come on. I should have just left it there. I just got hit. Did you get hit, too? Yeah, but he missed. They're yeah, not hit hold on, hold on, hold on. Go ahead, yeah. Go slow. <laughs> See my point? It's not just me, man. It's not me. Promise you. Oh, that one I missed. The only reason I set that because I felt them pull. This just looks good too, man. Oh. 
take it. It just came off. <laughs> you weren't even paying attention. Hell no. I wasn't gonna set the hook on this anyways unless something gave me a reason to. <laughs> Don gave me a reason to. Well, there's one. First fish in two days, huh? Man. <laughs> I'll tell you right now, after a full day and not catching a damn thing, that feels great. <laughs> I Sound like a good hit. Swing and a miss. Where was he, back there? Right in between that freaking, not over there. You missed completely. Oh, oh you didn't miss. He came back for it. Did he? Yeah. First time he hit it, dude, like four feet away. <laughs> he was like, oh wait, that wasn't it. Cause I was pulling it over the grass. Oh. And it's not, you know, I'm not working it slow cause it's a buzz. He was so small though, he got stuck on top too. Damn. <laughs> Swim with me, swim with me. <laughs> I, I got we... one! <laughs> I got <laughs> Yes! 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 <laughs> I'm not a failure! <laughs> Life means something to me now! <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> You see how long I waited? Hell of a long. <laughs> that fool was damn near chewing on it. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. Hook him? Hmm? You hooked him? Mm-mm. I mean... You know what? No, I want a five pounder. Hmm. Just, just to at least walk up with something like, hey, look, this is what I could do, you know? This day one wasn't eh, but you know what? I don't even care. What the fuck? I don't know, the Delta's been weird this year too. It's been, I mean, it's been better than last year for sure, but it's still not the same. No, heck no. Put them in here. I guess, the, I guess that was right on cue, huh? <laughs> it's a good one. Yeah. Guys, I have nothing to say. I'm ashamed of myself. I wasn't even talking on the camera. It's just been a straight. This has been a straight struggle. You over there trying to get the fish? <laughs> We're gonna release this fish. When there's only one fish, it's a lot harder. It's 11.30. By the time we get back to Frank's, it'll be 12. I mean, there's no point in us even weighing this fish in. But it's uh, <sighs> it's been a struggle, to say the least. Hey, bro, you all right? So, I mean, I appreciate y'all watching, though. I mean, I don't know how long we're going to stay for the weigh-ins. I don't work tomorrow, so, I mean, we got first uh, weigh-ins. Yeah, at least he's lively. There's, uh, there's the fish. So, it wasn't a bad one, but uh, it's the it. only one. Yeah. Jesus he's Christ. Gone. <laughs> But yeah, it's been it's been a tough day or two days. I mean, I like doing these regardless. But oh man, they just make they beat you up. So if we get out of here early enough, we're gonna go watch Deadpool. We're gonna go watch Deadpool and Wolverine. Um, 
but I don't know. We're going to get back to the lot, cook some chicken probably, and then wait for Lloyd. He, uh, he, um. I will do it. Are, are those little ba baby stripers. stripers, though? Um, Lloyd comes in, I think, an hour later, so. We'll be uh, over there, probably record some weigh-ins, and then, uh, I don't know, maybe we'll record at the end. Depends if we stay, but we got to go pack everything up, but. I'll see you guys later on. I'm just... <laughs> <laughs>
forgot to uh, we forgot to weigh it as a big fish, but it was it was well over like what? It was well over seven. Oh, I still a thousand bucks yeah. or something. Yeah. You'll learn next time, guys. They're new at it. But let's hear it for our runners up in UFC 10. Best crowd a winner. We had 1972. They're gonna get $1,800 to the team of Trima and Wayman, your champions for UFC 10. Come on, Trima and Wayman. Did it again. Now be careful. That's in the bed. I didn't get this as a dollar tree. We wanted this more than we wanted. We wanted it. Say that again. We wanted the trophy more than we wanted. Okay. Tell us how you got it. I'm frog. <laughs> <laughs> That's a dumb question. Get a, 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 a dumb I'm sorry. answer back. I'm sorry. Okay. I'm sorry, man. That's all right. Uh, what kind of frog? What band? Uh, a snack group, actually. An old snack group. Yep. Okay. Uh, he was throwing a snack group. I was throwing a swamp. He was throwing the swamp donkey. Swamp lord. Swamp lord and the snack group. Well, you you threw your way to victory in UFC 10. Um, congratulations. Let's hear it for our M. Our winners, winners. Fish on the pro side. Second big fish was good for one thousand dollars for second big fish, and we're gonna give that to the team of Carpenter and Boss Rex. Seven eighty four for second big fish. Come on up. Look at that. Oh man, you gonna throw your back out? Look at it, doing a grip off, man. Look at that. You don't know nothing about that. Uh, where's your partner at? We coming. Come on up, man. We coming. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Oh, good. All right. Did you catch it or he catch the big fish? Yeah, Come on it. over here and talk to me. And, and man, man, don't make this war piece. Just say what you guys think about this kid. Say what no, I say. I just did. You got the big fish. What's catch that second big fish on? Uh, we had a river to see a uh, big taco with a rattle on the back of it. Okay. Uh, it was uh, white and chartreuse, uh, chartreuse and white tails on it. Okay. All right. Good job. Good job. Second big fish. You guys going over there and wait a minute. And we're going to see what you got. We got to get some pictures on you for you. With that comes 500 bucks. Let's hear for Travis Huckabee and Brendan Diamond, your winners from the River to Sea. They won the Royal Rumble. The Royal Rumble. You can see us won this trophy. It's a manufacturer, for those that you don't know, they, every crowd company gets a representative and they go out there and fish. They fish in a regular event, but they also fish for this big trophy to bring back to the home office. We've done this for 10 years. River Sea has won it three times. This is the fourth time they won it. They get a, I think they get a year's worth of advertising with English Press to promote their frog. Tell us what frog you got it on. You're on camera. Awesome, yep. <laughs> we caught the fish all on the River to Sea. That's the Ish's Fat Man, Fat Matt Daddy Frog. And it strikes they, again. Exactly. Yeah, with a little bit of credit to Ish. But uh, caught it on the midnight. So all of our fish came on the midnight. Fat Matt Daddy Frog. Fat Matt Daddy Frog is in the house. Let's hear it from the manufacturer's cut, the Royal Rumble. The winner. All right. Now let's put our hands together for our runners up for UFC 10. UFC 10, they had a total weight of 2835 for six fish. They're going to get, check this out. $4,200, $4,200 to the team of Joey and Joey Stim. Let's hear it. Woo! <laughs> everywhere, everywhere you get a lot of fish, a few, what, what? Uh, yeah, we kind of stayed in one area uh, the majority of the weekend, but we didn't catch that many fish yesterday, but today, yeah, we put it right It was like one of those special days, you know what I mean? Like, everything just went right. What kind of frog were you throwing? Uh, I throw the Pro-G-Bank smoke crop, so all black. Yeah, next time you need to get them in the manufacturing stuff so you can represent. They won it one time. Yep, yep, next year for sure. All right, these are your runners off in the UFC 10. You guys, let's hear it for Joey and Joey Stam. And I'm going to have presenting this trophy, the one and only, the big guy, Vince Blum. Everybody, Vince Blum, the big guy, come on up from Folsom Lake Ram, one of our new sponsors. You guys used to see him. The big guy is back. The last year, we have the He's one of the owners of Folsom Lake. I want you to present. Here are those trophies over here. And you guys present. The big guy is back and he's handing out trophies. This, they had 3177. They're going to get a total of $7,500. Let's hear it from Bui and Hung Ho! Big champion! Yeah. I told you guys, he's not just 
got another pretty face. She can catch him. Oh. You did it. All right, you know, the good news is that you won. The bad news is that you won with your wife, so you can't tell her I didn't make no money today. <laughs> <laughs> She's going to take that money at least half of it. Tell her, man, I haven't seen you this smiling this long. It finally came together for me. Finally came together for me. Thank How'd you do it? Uh, listen up, everybody. Scrofog. Scrofog. The Kiora, the small one. Okay. You gotta work it, jack on. That's like a real, real slow. Okay. You gotta work it real slow. Yeah. When you get that big nine pounder, did she come up real quick or with the first thing? Did she jump a lot? Did you were shaking her knees? Tell us about that. Oh, actually, I'm fishing on a Wednesday night and she jumped up like a twice trying to try to stop my fall. Okay. Like yesterday, I went back there and about 10 to 20 minutes. It's very rare that you go <laughs> and miss a fish on Wednesday, come back in a tournament yeah. and catch that 7,500 feet and new UFC champions. Let me tell you something. He's not just a sponsor. This guy is a big game hunter, loves to fish, loves to do all the things you guys love to do, and wanted to be part of this. Let's hear it, you guys, for Vince Blum, the big guy's back. Thank you very much, Vince. I appreciate that. Uh, Vince is right. We go way back. He is a good friend. I've learned to know that anything that Vince Harris is associated with is a success. So he literally was the first uh, call I made to uh, a vendor or anything like that. And I said, hey, man, let's get back in the game again. He schooled me on catching fish at my house. It was an awesome <laughs> afternoon, and we put a plan together. And uh, so I'm super tickled pink to be here and to be uh, sponsoring you guys and just involved with the community. That's like Vince said, I grew up hunting and fishing in a small little town, so this is what I enjoy best. This is where I'm most comfortable. And you guys are very good people on top of all that. So thank you for your support. And if you want a vehicle, we have three salespeople that are, you know, like fleet retail guys. They cater to you. You have special pricing. And then I'm going to be living there for the first couple of years until, you know, I can go on some cool fishing trips and stuff like that. So come see me and I'll absolutely take care of you. Thank you for your support. All right. That's the big guy, you guys. And we appreciate you, Vince. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Now, I want to tell you, hey, wait, Vince, one, one, one more thing. What is that record, uh, Elf? Uh, what was it? How big was he? 426 and 3 eighths. Okay. This guy, you guys think he's a hunter? Wait, is it the state record? Well, it was, but it got beat. Okay, he had the state record elk. It was what? 426 and 3 eighths. 426 and 3 eighths. I don't know what that means, but I'm, I saw it in his house, and it was huge. I won it in a raffle, so it was the biggest raffle bowl I've ever taken, not the biggest one. But you so you caught it, you shot it. I, yeah, yeah, I got it. I, thought they I got home. it. It's on my wall at home, right? They might have thought you won it in a raffle. Yeah, but the no, mount. no, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was an adventure. Okay, I am just awesome. I just wanted to prove to you guys that this guy is a, a hunter, a fisherman, an outdoorsman, and is part of what you guys are part of. Thanks again, Ben, for being part of this. Amen. We appreciate Thank you. It. Woo! Big clothes for big guys back. Okay, all right, let's get... That's a wrap. UFC 10, the 10th year anniversary of the Ultimate Frog Challenge has finally come to an end. And we had a great feel, 165 of the best frog fishermen in Northern California, putting it all on the line here in the California Delta. And our winner was none other than Hung Ho and Mui Long. Hung, come on over here. Go. They won, they had 3175, forget this, six fish catching them all on frogs. He caught him on the Spro Frog, and um, the winnings was $7,500. Man, tell us real quick how you caught the fish, where you caught them, uh, or you know, you may not want to tell you because you might want to fish the other event. It, don't matter. Group. it they, doesn't matter. Tell us a little bit about it real quick. Uh, most of the time, I use a Spro Frog 
the Chaco. Okay, the, ya uh, the Jackal? Uh, the Jackal okay. and uh, Kaora, okay. the small one. The small one. You walk it real slow on the Thule line. On the Thule line. You catch yep. fish all day, both days? A uh, lot of fish? A lot of fish. Like oh. this morning, and then we got 15, one, only one, one spot, 15 fish. One spot. The, the biggest is like a three and a half. Yeah, the beauty of this event is you can use any frog you want to. We had our, uh, the top frog award, the Manufacturer's Cup was won by River to Sea, Ishes, Fat Matt Daddy. That's their fourth title that they've won for the Royal Rumble. But we had a great time and he fishes with his wife, Mui. And Mui is not, as I say, she's not just another pretty face. She <laughs> knows how to get them. You guys, UFC 10 was a great success. We want to thank Gone Fishing Marine of Dixon, California, your number one boat dealer in Northern California. And we want to thank our newest sponsor, Folsom Lake Chrysler Jeep Ram. The big guy's back. You guys come and see him. And we'll see you guys at UFC 11 next year in 2025. Good fishing, everybody. Thank you, guys.